What's up, everybody? Hey, it is time for a first episode review. It's me and Ryan tonight. Yeah, just chilling on the just DL. Hanging, hanging out. Hanging out. <laughs> uh, you got your Retro Rick hat on. Hey, you got to rep, rep that merch. That's pretty sweet. Go check it out. He's oh, got merch that. in the store now. So much good stuff. Different, oh, my goodness. different design hats, shirts, all that. They look great, too. Yeah. yeah, yeah. he's done a great Legit job. Legit hats. Sweet. So we're going to jump into something I think is very near and dear to probably both of our hearts. Uh, X Men the animated series. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, oh my favorite, favorite, favorite. Oh, favorite. It's so good, y'all. And you know they're bringing it back. X Men '97, the 97. series, is coming out soon. It's gonna be super good. So we're gonna check awesome. out the very first episode of X Men the animated series from the '90s, and I uh, hope you guys enjoy it with us. Oh yeah, let's do it. Yeah, bub, bub. <laughs> Okay, so first off, you obviously yeah. you have to point out you can never skip the the theme song. The theme song, ever, ever, ever. It's absolutely incredible. One of the best. Golly. Top, top three. Yep. So good. I like that they point out and like name all the characters too. Also, the names of the characters are like if you see them in their own like individual comic book. Oh. That's the font that's on the oh, comic Oh, for books. the comic. Dang, that's cool. Yep. Okay, so lately, I, I think I've shown you this. Lately, I'm, I'm part of this uh, X Men Addicts Facebook group, <laughs> and this dude has been buying mannequins oh, and yeah. making them look like these Paint characters, them. and it's freaking so insane. Look, so look, so, so good. I so would good. have those things all over my house. <laughs> oh my gosh. Y'all gotta check it out. X Men Addicts, I'm pretty sure, is the group on Facebook. Uh -huh. you'll, you'll see it. He posts all the time. I think he's doing Jubilee now. He is. Yeah, he actually made some little uh, sparkle little things. Little things, whatever, that light up. <laughs> so cool. The fact that the perpetrator is believed oh, to be a mutant has fueled yeah. courage wow. anti-mutant So we're going to start out with some Sabertooth action. He's yeah. destroying everything. As always. Yes. <laughs> She's one of them, one, right? She needs help. TV is huge. Uh, was, yeah, it's the 90s, bro. You got a big screen TV. <laughs> it probably weighs a thousand pounds, too. <laughs> exactly. Now, I remember this episode like the back of my hand, man. I probably watched this a bunch. I did have the VHS uh, from Pizza Hut Yep, that had this on there. He's a Here's old Jubilee. Never understand. I always thought she looked so cool, man. Yep. Why is this happening to me? Yep. Same <laughs> For some reason, the, the 90s, like, that style Sentinel, mm. like, Creeps me out. Oh, for real? <laughs> Just like, dang. Gives me the heebie jeebies. Is it a look of them or is I it like so. when they talk? Okay, yeah. That is like, they everything. Just look terrifying. <laughs> oh, they look terrifying, yeah. <laughs> I will say, I do feel like in video game representation, they haven't done a very good job with Sentinels. Not, I haven't played every X Men game, so I may be very Are wrong about sorry? this. I, my mind goes back to the arcade. Oh, yeah. Where they're like the same size as the X Men. Yeah. You that's know? That's true. Which I get. I mean, how do you how do you put that in a video hard game? Hard. Yeah. Error. Non -living objects. Begin tracking program. Come on. In the mall. I'll teach you to invade probably. My probably, yeah. Because Jubilee was a mall rat. Oh, yeah. Yep, in the mall. What do you want me to do? Exactly. <laughs> Who do you think I am? Yeah. I ain't got no powers. Yeah. You know how much that game costs? Yeah, a quarter. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I think she, I don't. I was gonna say I think she is just now discovering her powers. I think so. Yeah. Sort of. You got Storm and Rogue oh, now. Yeah. What bug crawled up her sort? I miss malls. Oh, I mean, yeah. there's still a few around here and there, but they're just not the same. There, yeah, there's hardly anything in them now. Yeah. <clears throat> I wish I would have been old enough whenever, like, the the mall tours were happening. You know, like, they used to have artists like Tiffany, you yeah. know, when it's discovered in the mall. But they would have, like, like different bands and things oh, play in malls. be awesome. Okay, so fun fact. My favorite mall scene of all time is from Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. So the music over the top of that, like the cops are running around trying to cut, catch all the bat, all the uh, the historical characters. Oh yeah. And the band Extreme has a song called "Play with Me" over okay. the top of that, and uh, Nuno Betancourt 
plays a solo in that song that is insanely good. I always thought Storm was like good in concept, but yeah. like I always kind of felt like she was pretty weak. Like Storm she used her good. powers and like she would drain big time, you know. Storm. You'll miss a rogue. <laughs> yes, rogue has a way with men. <laughs> yeah, for <Sugar>? real. <laughs> Come here, sugar. I got you. Like oh, and Gambit. Oh yeah. Oh, man. I always love Gambit. Yeah. Don't go away. Also poorly represented in the movies, like it just really hasn't yeah. come off for him yet. I really feel like if they could do a standalone Gambit movie that would be super sweet. It would be awesome, just not with Channing Tatum. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Where you going, Petit? Anywhere but here. Stand aside. Apprehend this. Yeah. I feel like I've seen a lot of hate on Jubilee, but I, mm. I never had that big of a problem with it. No, I always thought she was super cool. And maybe it's because, like, they started this series out with her. Like, mm. like she's kind of the main character for yeah. a little while, for you know? Little, yeah. I don't believe this. Run, girl! Yeah, see, she's still trying to figure this out. Yeah, yeah that's cool. I love what a good origin story. What did you do story. to anybody? <laughs> I didn't ask to be a mutant. As long as it's not redone four or five over times. and over, yeah. <laughs> Spider Man, <laughs> Fantastic Four. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of Fantastic Four, the new one coming out Who next year. Cyclops. I think Get they down. said it's not going to be any type of origin story. So okay. they're just going to get right into it. Sweet. So I think it's going to be pretty awesome. Now, have they casted? Are they going with John Krasinski? I hope so. Oh gosh. I would hope so because I think he'd so be cool. an awesome. Also, yeah. Mr. Fantastic. He did a great job in Doctor Strange. Mm -hmm. For the very short amount of time he was in. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Where am I? What is this place? You fried a girl? Yeah. It's Our funny, too, because she's got her gloves on. Yeah. And her powers can transfer through that. But you think about Rogue, and she's always wearing gloves, so she doesn't. Mm -hmm. Like, her powers won't affect anybody. Right. Mutant powers definitely Rogue is have just their advantages. Th Touching her skin or whatever skin. that drains, or like she absorbs your powers or whatever. It would be quite yeah. disconcerting if this were to. Oh, Hank McCoy. Oh, Beast was so cool, man. He's awesome. Just part of the growing menace of mutant violence. More. Mm -hmm. I am an mm -hmm. idiot. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Would it be so cool to be able to do that? Yeah. Walking around Walmart. Turning into everybody you see. <laughs> every every person you walk by, yeah. Domino. Cannonball. Gene, I knew the existence of the X-Men. Oh. Be revealed. Always loved his that yellow wheelchair, wheelchair from this series. And it was freaking represented in Doctor Strange yes, too. So cool. Yeah, oh my it was. gosh. It's awesome. Oh girl, you up in the danger room oh. now. It's about to get real. There is danger everywhere. Yeah, danger this is a new place for you. Oh uh -oh. yeah, the Wolverine, you Wolverine is. You know, it's kind of crazy because in the animated series, Wolverine kind of takes Jubilee under his wing. Uh -huh. And then when the first X-Men movie came out, like they did that same thing with Rogue. With Rogue, yeah. Yeah. What is this weird place? One part gymnasium, one part survival course. Affectionately referred to as Danger room. All of us here are mutants, like yourself. Well, tell me this. To throw off what the ledge. That's to right. Test your powers. What are your test powers? Your might. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Justin. My name's Jubilee. I blow stuff up. You've come. Yeah, but with like sparklers. Yeah, with firecrackers. <laughs> Aren't you guys a little old for school, or did you all get held back? Speaking of. I think I remember y'all had a X-Men game on PlayStation 1. Yes. I think it was Mutant Academy. Mutant Academy, yeah. I actually still it's think like, I have it. It's, I think it's up here behind me somewhere. Dang. But then why do people hate us? People fear what they do not understand. People fear what they fear. You guys are scary. Like, yeah. you can do crazy well, stuff. <laughs> don't you kill me. <laughs> yeah, don't you were just please, summoning lightning. <laughs> Does your daughter uh, have any oh. mutant friends? I bet it's him. Perhaps. We don't really know much about her friends. I gotta make sure they're okay. Oh. 
How do you know? <laughs> Giant sentinel <laughs> hiding behind a building. He, like. There was a tree though in front of him too, though. See, just like that Only tree. Only as tall as his knees. Oh yeah. Oh, that didn't really do much. Oh, oh no. double yep. team. You're done. What is that? It's a oh gas. Okay. Oh, I thought she was getting a steam bath. <laughs> right. You look dirty. You're dirty as well. That building is the headquarters of the mutant control agency. Somewhere in there are the registration files of hundreds of mutants. That chair looks too big for that room. How did he get in there? <laughs> and we shred him. I'd get in there alone. Easy. No, Storm will cool, take we'll bring that time to change her. clothes. We'll yeah. <laughs> Had to get into his lumberjack clothes. <laughs> That's right, my, my outdoor gear. <laughs> Damn it. I go in like this, huh? <laughs> Game is like I hate this guy. Oh, I hate, I hate, my hate life. it. <laughs> <laughs> He'd probably get on my nerves. Yeah, probably so. But when you formed the X Men, was it not to teach us to use our powers to benefit mankind, so ordinary people would learn not to fear us? Don't you remember? I can read your mind. Okay. <laughs> exactly. Stop I know talking. what you're saying. Okay. <laughs> you don't have to say it. Cold feet. I always Anytime. liked the, the conflict between them two. Oh, yeah. You know, Jean kind of stuck in the middle. Yeah. I just went to check on Jubilee. She's gone. Where are I go. I wanna go. Where I wanna go. It's a very <laughs> popular <laughs> phrase by Wolverine. Yeah. Gambit. Let him go. Dang, what, what, what's Gambit's beef here? Uh, he's not worth it. Everybody, stay close. Not too close. You know, <laughs> I remember I always loved the X Men jet. Oh, no, so boyfriend. cool. That's when the boys quit calling. Ah, she was always so bad to bone. You sure make a lot of noise. You decide to join us, eh? Yeah. Storm ain't waiting. She's just like, we're going for this. <laughs> Let's get it going. Yeah. Are you all right? Never better. What? Yeah, that freaked me out. When yeah, it's like other than his morphing power, like he doesn't have anything else. So no, he's I don't think so. Pretty uh, it's kind of weak. Yeah, vulnerable. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, holla at you. Jk. <laughs> <laughs> I feel it's like the uh, like the Legolas Gimli uh, deal where they're trying to one up uh, each other. You yeah. know. Yeah. We'll mm. see them as well as the mist rises. Storm just owned this thing, man. Alright, right. <laughs> But when it gets down to it and like things get serious, she can be like, oh, I can't do oh, anything. I'm oh, tired. help me. <laughs> I'm tired. Exactly. Secure. It'd be cool to see an origin story of, of Hank, like having oh, a beast, yeah. like have That'd a movie. Be awesome. That'd be really cool. Ooh. Y'all finna get got. For real. That's it. Oh, it's part one. Oh, it is part one. Dang. Left you on a little cliffhanger there. Yeah. Hey, I will say this was always super cool to me. Whenever they would do uh, all these CG characters, oh, yeah. because this was something you didn't really see a whole lot. Yep. And so I always thought it was really cool they did this. Kind of like the beginning of the whole CG era. Yeah, yeah. And they're telling like uh, Staff. little stats yeah. and stuff. Abilities. Attributes and stuff, mm -hmm. yeah. I never even noticed that. I love that. Dang, that's crazy. Well, that is Night of the Sentinels Part 1. Part 1. Now we got to watch Part 2. I know, right? Gosh. Uh, we're going to we're gonna simplify things going forward. So we're just going to talk about... Okay, so we watched the first episode... What do we think about it? Would it be something that we would continue to watch? So based on the first episode, will we continue to watch the series? <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. Same here. the best cartoon ever. It's phenomenal. It oh my so gosh. Good. So, I mean, I love like the animation. There were a couple of shows. I think the Spider-Man show yep. was the same was animation. Similar. Um, I feel like there was something else too. There was like Silver Silver Surfer was pretty similar. That's right. There was yeah. Fantastic there Four. was a Fantastic Four. That's right. Um, I think 
there was actually a Doctor Strange cartoon as well, but I'm not too sure. Oh, yeah. I, I know remember. they've redone it recently with like more anime style for Doctor mm -hmm. Strange. But yeah. yeah. So, anyways, yeah. X-Men. Oh, gosh. I did. I watched the fire out of this show when I was a kid. In fact, I was much more like X-Men than I was like Captain America and oh, Hulk yeah. and me things too. like that. Probably. I had a ton of cards. I had a ton of comics. Yeah. Unfortunately for me, like an idiot kid... I'm pretty sure I traded my entire X-Men collection for like like a Sega Genesis. Oh. I mean, terrible. <laughs> and yeah. I know, and I think I had the complete 94, I think I had the complete 95 set of cards. And, you know, probably a stack of like maybe 100 comics or something. I don't know. Damn. Super okay. stupid. <laughs> but Sega oh, wow. was awesome at the time, yeah, you know? Was so I cool. thought it was great. But anyways, yeah, I loved it. I thought it was super cool. Um, I, I really like the voice actors in this, and I'm super glad that they're bringing it back. Yeah. I, I think the majority watch, of the cast. Yeah. I, I'm not sure on the cast. I haven't really read into it, but yeah. I think uh, I think they're probably going to do really good with this. I think so, too. Yeah. So, anyways, guys, that was the first episode of X-Men. Obviously, it is a two-parter, so we've got Night of the Sentinels Part 2 that we could watch. Uh, make sure you do check it out. I think it's on uh, Disney Plus. Yes, I think it it's is. on Disney Plus. Mm -hmm. So make sure you go and watch it if you never watched it. Uh, did you watch this growing up? Was it super cool to you? Let us uh, know. Yeah. Did you enjoy this? Hey, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Hang out with us every single week. We're gonna be dropping more first episode reviews. We'll catch you guys later.